There's a rumor that if you shoot at a frozen lake, the bullet will spin like a top across the ice. But does that really happen in real life? To find out, they first needed to figure out the angle at which the bullet hits the ice. Based on a viral video, the shooter appeared to be about 6 feet tall, and the bullet seemed to hit the ice at roughly a 42-degree angle. Tori then built an adjustable shooting rig that could precisely control the firing angle. Next, they laid down thick blocks of ice to simulate a frozen lake surface and to help capture the bullet's bounce pattern. One challenge was figuring out whether the spinning effect came from the bullet hitting the ice directly or from it bouncing off and spinning afterward. The first test was done at the 42-degree angle. The bullet struck the ice and skipped off, and while they did find the impact point, the bullet wasn't spinning. They continued testing with multiple bullets, but none of them spun, and some completely vanished. Just when they were about to give up and declare the myth busted, they caught something interesting in the original video. Now listen. Can you hear that? A distinct spinning sound, possibly from the bullet. This gave the myth a second life. They headed out to a real frozen lake and dug out a shooting range directly on the ice. Despite a raging snowstorm, they pressed on with the test. After firing 20 rounds with no results, the extreme cold and tough conditions started to take a toll on morale. But during the final magazine, they adjusted the firing angle and finally saw their first spinning bullet. That moment brought a little warmth in the middle of the storm. They kept testing, and shot after shot, the bullets kept spinning beautifully across the ice. Turns out, the key is in the angle and the height. The bullet must enter the ice at no more than a 30-degree angle and from a height of no more than 5 feet. Under those conditions, the spinning effect is almost guaranteed. After 70 miles of snowy travel and brutal conditions, they proved the myth to be true. 